Hello, my name is Ernst Fleming and I'm Product Manager for Oscilloscopes. Today I want to show you the powerful trigger capability of the RTO oscilloscopes when triggering 100 base T1 automotive Ethernet. What you see here is the Ethernet decoding of automotive Ethernet that's captured with the Ethernet probing fixture RTZF5. But you notice the yellow one are the MAC frames, the gray one is the idle frames. You notice this is not a stable trigger picture. So what you can do is you can now go into the trigger menu, select the bus that you want to trigger on, and you see the different trigger capabilities. When we look into the error capability, we can trigger on preamble error, CRC error, and SFD error. We will look into the idle frames that can be isolated, so now it triggers on all the idle frames. We can work on the MAC frames, and here you have the capability to isolate specifically all MAC frames, or you can isolate specific decimation, destination address, source address, length, frame check, and even data. So when we select that option, you will notice that we are now able to specifically trigger on MAC frames that you see here. It's very stable triggering on any MAC frame. And this is especially helpful when you want to look into specific MAC frame events or information that's transmitted via the MAC frame, or when you look into the triggering on errors when you want to isolate errors on the bus. So this is about the powerful triggering capability with the trigger and decode option RTO K57 with the RTO oscilloscope. Thank you very much.